Hi, I'm Jen. And I'm Daryl. Welcome to Planted in Paradise. This week, we try to get a permit for a cidery. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll hear back by next week. Yes, but Jen and I have been busy. Jen wants to do a nice tour. Come and join us. Let's take a tour of the cidery. Come on. As you come into the cidery, you have a closet on your left, the bathroom straight ahead, and a sitting area to your right. Turning completely to the right, we have a small hallway that takes us into the main part of the cidery. The first room area you come to is on the left, and it is going to be a games room of sorts. You can see a bar area where you can play games, a chair for reading, you can see a look into the kitchen, and over on your left side of there we have a display cabinet, but I'm hoping to also have a Murphy bed here that will double as an additional sleeping area. I'm taking a quick little look into the kitchen as we turn around. The bar area that we have set up here is directly below some of the gears and pulley system for the cider mill, which we want to keep intact. The bar helps people from hitting their heads as they walk through. We are now entering the living room area where we have a big screen TV set up, a couple of couches and a chair, for more visiting, more game playing, relaxing. In the back you can see our dining room with a sliding glass door that will look out to the back deck. deck the deck is going to be part two of the build, cidery build. We're now walking through the dining room area and into the kitchen which has a breakfast bar and a couple of stools. And you can see it is a full kitchen. It has a dishwasher, sink, fridge and freezer, and a full cooktop and range. This may not be the permanent location for the cooktop and range because we have to put in an overhead exhaust fan and that might be expensive to do in the middle of the room. So we may have to move it to the back wall to have a wall mounted air exchange. There's plenty of cabinet space or counter space and some nice open shelving and a way to look into the backyard from the sink area. And as we turn we get a look at the cidery from the southwest view. You can see the dining room, the entertainment area, the games room and we're walking past our beautiful brick chimney. Eventually we may have a wood stove or fireplace attached to that. You'll notice there's a weird pattern on the walls as we're looking around. That's just um, the way we had to choose a finish for the walls. That's actually going to be uninsulated for the summer coming up. So all you're seeing there is is the walls, the unfinished walls of the cidery. So lots of old barn wood. We have a nice large table here. It currently looks like it's sitting six, but I'm hoping to have one that sits eight to ten people, as eventually this cidery will be able to sleep at least at least eight. There are stairs going up to the next floor, which again is in a future edition of the cidery. That's not what we're planning on having ready for this summer. Although there will be beds upstairs for those who don't mind sleeping in an unfinished space. We're making our way from the dining area into the living room area where we're going to get a look from the northeast corner of the building. I may have my directions wrong. <laughs> so we're getting a look at the entryway turning around, looking out the front windows, 
That looks at a barn that's across the way. Um, not a horrible eyesore, but one that we do want to eventually clean up. There's the entryway again. Turning around to see the Murphy bed area, the games room, the kitchen, and finally the living room and dining room. We're pretty excited. I think this is turning out pretty well. We're back at the beginning now. We're going into the bathroom. We have our beautiful green tub there, as you can see. We're hoping to again restore that so that we can keep it saves with cost and it also keeps a little bit of the history of the building in there. We have a pocket door, sink to the right with a medicine cabinet above it and the toilet. I'm not sure if we're going to tile this wall or if it's going to be barn board. We'll see. That decision can be made later. We have a door that goes out to the back deck from here and a laundry area. The door is, the purpose of the door here is that eventually we'd like to have a hot tub out on the deck. So rather than having somebody traipse all the way through the cidery, they can come in through this back door directly into the bathroom to shower and or use the bathroom. And turning around, you see a little stool spot to sit down, take off your shoes, put some of your items and looking out from the bathroom out into the main entranceway again. And that concludes our cidery tour.